Hey guys, this lesson is on uh, kind of getting to polarization and stuff. So let's say we have, um, well, let's talk about a neutral atom first. So let's talk about, like we have this neutral atom here, no charge, uh, no, no positive, no negatives. So um, it's important to uh, know that a neutral atom doesn't have, it, it doesn't mean it doesn't have positive and negative, it just means it has the same amount of negative as positive charged particles in it. So it is neutral. So um, I guess I could say it's a negatives equal to positives. It's kind of a way well, you could kind of write that. And um, I guess I should draw this more as an atom. Imagine this is like, here is your nucleus. And um, in your atom, uh, you have your really massive nucleus in the middle. That's really small. Uh, compared to like the whole um, atom and uh, that's made out of protons and neutrons so essentially you have your positively charged center here because it's all protons and neutrons and neutrons don't have any charge but protons do sorry it's kind of hard to see but these are uh, positive charges and on the outside you, of your uh, you have your electrons in a cloud over here and your electrons let's just draw them as like little balls flying around here isn't exactly what it looks like, but it, it's kind of conceptually. And the electrons are what you're negative. So you'll have uh, the same amount of negative and positive um, here if your atom's neutral spinning around. So let's say we have, uh, I'm going to draw it as a circle again, a circle over here, a neutral, a neutral atom right here. And let's say we have an electric field pointing this way. Say it's a universe. Uh, it's uh, uh, just a electric field pointing this way in general. So um, it's kind of a tendency, kind of to think that like, oh, since it's neutrally charged, the electric field won't affect it at all. But um, what will actually happen is it will polarize into a uh, dipole. So um, this is like kind of the new picture of what it would look like. This is kind of how we draw dipoles in physics. So since we know that the electric field is pointing this way, a good way to kind of think about it is that uh, negative electric fields point towards a negative and away from positive. So we, so we should know that the positive side is over here and the negative side is over here. And basically what this means is that the, I guess I should draw it more like this, the center of the atom, say this is our, again our nucleus, up here is kind of shifting towards the electric field or shifting uh, away from the electric field while the electrons aren't so electrons are kind of staying over spending more time over here and you get a essentially a dipole and those are just some conceptual things of uh, how uh, neutral atoms make dipoles if you have any questions on uh, this, just let me know and I'll make a video for it. Alright, see ya.